Now to a developing story we're following in Martin County after the old Coca-Cola bottling plant partially collapses. It happened in the town of Everett and officials are now concerned for the safety of residents. So for the latest, we go live now to WNCT's Josh Burge. Josh, what can you tell us? Well, Ken and Angela, things just now quieting down here. They brought in an excavator just in the last 30 minutes, and they were working at the top of the building trying to secure um, some pieces that look like they could possibly fall or fall over, and they went ahead and knocked that over. And the call for this partial collapse came in just before uh, 1 o'clock this afternoon. The major concerns, as you mentioned, the safety. This is a, a road that a lot of cars travel on. A lot of people walk up and down. It's right across the street from the post office, and officials here say it could have been a whole lot worse. It could have been a disaster if there had been a car or a person walking in this area at that time. We were thankful that there were no in injuries at this time. Another big concern moving forward is the railroad tracks. It's a CXX uh, train that goes right by there just a couple, uh, maybe 100 feet, maybe if that, uh, from this building. They're concerned that if a train were to go through, and there's normally about two trains that come through Everett's each day, the vibrations that it would create on the ground may uh, cause more of this building to collapse. That's obviously an issue. They've notified railroad officials. Uh, they have not yet made it out to the scene here. I talked to the building's owners and they say that they still have a uh, shop in the back that they use to work on cars. They were in it just yesterday. So obviously things here could have been a whole lot worse if, if somebody had been in that building or around it when it partially collapsed. We'll have uh, more information as long along with uh, what you can expect in the morning if you're coming through the efforts area. For now, we are live in efforts. Josh Birch, 9 on your side.